there's a lot of hearing loss uh, means like uh, cotton buds people use cotton buds and it's not really good for for the ears uh, you you will be compacting your earwax and some people do, and kids especially can damage their ears and so and we've done that literature in in, in english spanish and in, in arabic and um, and yeah that's the main message uh, to look at the social media leaflets and it's just change, we've got to change the mindset uh, of also the other mindset that other means is that the, you don't give importance to certain symptoms or oh, I don't need to wear hearing it or I don't, I'm not suffering from hearing loss so the literature that we are and the message we're giving is that you, you really you have to give importance to any any of the symptoms and have it properly looked after. How regularly and you know at what age people regularly get their ears checked or, or have a checkup in general about their hearing? Indeed, it's something that we try to encourage for people as part of their MOT in every uh, uh, milestone to have their hearing checked. But the truth is that people don't check their ears and especially the, the young people and unfortunately due to resources, uh, uh, lack of resources, uh, manpower in, in the GHA uh, there's no hearing screening in schools carried out, no at in Porton ages, no at the, the over 60s. Well, those are the, you know, it's important to screen children well before going to school because that communication development can be hindered. And, and the elderly, it's important because that's one third of the, of the elderly or the, of the over 60s will start to have hearing loss. And hearing loss has, and treated hearing, hearing loss has been linked to the occurrence of uh, dementia. You recently met with uh, Minister Christian Santos, I believe. Yes, How did yes, that meeting yes. go? And did you raise things like this, for example? Yeah, well, we spoke, uh, as you know, in the, in, in the past manifesto, uh, um, they gave some commitments because we previously had launched a, a wish list and we were talking and deliberating how we can move forward. I uh, was very pleased and and I'm excited uh, how uh, eager he is in helping and making ch changes for the better. And and yeah, I can't, only, can't stop waiting to get things done with him. And we see that you're wearing here a, a t-shirt. This in particular has been prepared for this year. Yes, we've, we've got two designs. This one that I'm wearing and a, a BSL themed one. Um, I thought we, we, we started doing the BSL themed only for the kids, but then we thought that some parents would like to wear the same t-shirt as the kids. And all of them are available at, at Matalan. All pre proceeds will go to, to us. And it's just £12 and you get a bag and you buy two.